I'll take a double triple bossy deluxe on a raft, four by four animal style, extra shingles with a shimmy and a squeeze. How's it going guys? It's your boy Round Tall Guy. Welcome back to the channel. I'm, I'm making a quick video on the pressure washer again guys. Uh, just because I got the phone cannon in the shop finally so we can test it out and see how good this Harbor Freight $80 pressure washer will work with the phone cannon on your vehicle. Now I went ahead and went to Amazon. I got the uh, phone cannon right here. It came with all these adapters as well. And this is pretty awesome. I haven't tried it yet, so I'm not sure if it's gonna work or not. I also ordered this adapter here. Now you're gonna need this wand. I think it's what it's called, a wand. Uh, so you can attach it to the handle over there. Just because this is the stock one that came with the uh, pressure washer. And if you look at it, it has the exact same end. But if you look over here, this one is where the water comes out of. And there's no way to attach the foam cannon to that. So you're gonna you're gonna have to order this one right here. This one has a quick male disconnect. So you get attached the uh, foam cannon from here and you should be all set. Now the issue about this is you can't change the stream. Luckily for this foam cannon, I guess people already know what type of conversion you're doing. So they added this awesome attachment so you can change it. Like for example, this one is a zero degree stream. This one is a 25 um, degree. This is just wide open. This is, see if the camera can focus, 40 degrees. And this one is 15 degrees. So it, it came with these awesome attachments. All you have to do is just put them in the end here, click them on, snap them on, and you should be good to go. Now this is all you need to convert this uh, pressure washer to accept the foam cannon and to get all soapy. So of course we're gonna use the Chemical Guys um, Extreme Body Wash and Wax again, uh, just because apparently that one's pretty good when it comes to foam. All right, and before I forget, let me show you the different spray nozzles attachments the kit came with. So right now, all I have is the wand. This is just open. And, and basically that's, that's basically it. Yeah, that just to fill up like your bucket and stuff like that. Now we're gonna go ahead and try this open black one right here. And, as, and to put this on, all you have to do is push back on the collar, insert it, make sure it's all the way, release the collar, make sure it locks up and there you go. Try it out. All right, so this is the widest you can get it. All right, the next one we're gonna try is this red one right here. This is zero degrees. All right, so basically the, the red one just shoots straight. All right, next one is this yellow one. And this is a 15 degree uh, spray pattern. So we're gonna test this one out next. All right, the next one is 25 degrees. All right, and the last one we have is a 40 degree spray pattern. Now this white one, now this one, I, this is the one I recommend using for cleaning cars just because it's wide enough to reach the, the whole panel. Um, yes, you can use the other ones, but my favorite one is this white one with the uh, 40 degree um, width. So we just waiting for my friend to bring his JK Jeep here. Uh, that car went through a lot of off-roading, a lot of mudding. So that car is baked with mud, dust, and grime. So this is a perfect vehicle we're gonna try this pressure washer and this foam cannon with, and hopefully we get some awesome results. And of course, um, I'm gonna put this uh, pressure washer to the test. I'm gonna use it a lot, abuse it a lot, to see if it overheats, to see if it shuts off on me, to see if the um, pressure becomes weak over time. So we just wait for him to show up. And there he is, showed up <laughs> just in time. All right, so we got the handle and the wand attached. It attaches the same way, kind of clockwise to unlock it. And we went ahead and connected the foam cannon. We filled it up with uh, two ounces of soap and the rest is all water. We already adjusted the uh, knob and the handle. So now we're gonna, we're gonna test it out on this Jeep. And as you can see, this Jeep is pretty dirty all around so this is an awesome vehicle to test it out on 
All right, this is going to be the first run with the actual foam cannon. Let's see if it works. All right, and it looks like we ran out of soap. So with the foam cannon uh, having two ounces of soap and the rest of water, we managed to coat about three fourths of the Jeep. So that's pretty good for a small bottle. Now, as you can see, the foam is really thick and it goes down slowly. So honestly, this is pretty good. I mean, this is being my first foam cannon, my first pressure washer. I think I got a pretty good setup. So we're just gonna go ahead and continue foaming up the vehicle and then we're just gonna go ahead and clean it. All right, so we finished up foaming up the car and we also went ahead and cleaned the car. So now it's time to rinse it. Uh, for this, we're gonna use the 15 degree uh, nozzle that came with the kit onto the uh, wand. And we're gonna go ahead and just use a pressure washer to wash off all the soap. my final thoughts on this i honestly love this setup um it's 80 bucks for the pressure washer 20 bucks for accessories all together can get you some awesome foam action uh, i definitely recommend this uh, this is the cheapest you can go if you honestly want to start detailing cars with a foam cannon and pressure washer um honestly th this kit alone is all you that you need you need a foam cannon and then the different nozzles for you to have different um, spray patterns and that's basically it everything's good here i definitely recommend this for anyone who wants to start doing their own detailing or if you're like me who is just a diyer and you have multiple cars i definitely recommend this setup you waste less soap and you waste less water cleaning your car this way and as you've seen from the footage uh this thing honestly works 
Now, basically, I, I use chemical guys for the foam cannon. You can also use like McGuire's, like just regular car wash and stuff like that. And you're still gonna get foam. Um, not as much, but you're still gonna get foam. So I definitely recommend this kit for anyone. So I'm gonna end the video here. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And I will catch you next time. See you guys, bye-bye. Let me guess, tiny, a small salad. I'll take a double, triple bossy deluxe on a raft. Four by four animal style. Extra shingles with a shimmy and a squeeze. Light axle grease, make it cry, burn it, and let it swim. We serve food here, sir.